Hello everybody, and welcome back to yet another episode of SnowRunner. And I believe now we're still on episode 27 here, pretty much continuing off exactly where we were at in episode 26, where, as per Stewie's request, we went down the challenging route. And man oh man has it been a challenge. But, with a little bit of off-camera magic, to make you guys not have to endure all this craziness. We are still right here at that turn. And as I foretold, it was garbage. But hey, we have made it through this. Now it's pretty much just this turn up ahead here. And we'll be able to meet up with Stewie where we have foregoed the cargo that this truck had. But Stewie oh. has already picked up where I left that off kind man that he is and in the meantime we'll meet up sell this trailer and pretty much uh, I'll hook up the same kind of system that he has his minus uh, I think he has a little bit better of a setup but we will make do won't we Stu? Yep, well we'll try to yeah yep Screen looks a bit funny. Oh, it's going for this dead. Oh no, I don't want to do that. Alright. Oh, that crane thing again. And we've definitely done a lot of rescuing here. The king has had to come rescue. And it's done a fine job. Not exactly that. So we all know that the king is a big favorite of ours, and it's for good reason. Oh, I've, I've done kind of my favorite, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, the there's, there's no right doubt now, that I this like truck it. that we have now, it's a, it's a good truck. There's nothing to, to put on it. But for me, the king with everything that it's done and is capable of doing keeps on proving itself I, it's just you know it's a safe choice it's a safe choice we'll leave it at that it's a safe choice fair enough yeah all right i guess we can leave it at that <laughs> even though the as of seven has been uh it's been a miracle, child, to say the least. Hang on. What if I got myself... This camera could only work with me while I'm hanging on the throttle so as not to slip. Eh, we'll see. My crane can't reach that far, but we're gonna see what we can do to make this work. If I just chuck it up on the top here, it could latch on. Almost. Let's see what that does. Ah, uh, beautiful. Alright. I'll be back in a second, then I'll start driving again. But to those of you who are new to the channel, thank you for joining in with us. We do appreciate you coming in here, and welcome. And for the returning viewers, your support is always much appreciated. We have uh, pretty much done the majority of things that needed to be done here in Michigan. We are finishing up with the high ticket items. Still a fair bit of them, but for the more random things that we've been doing we're kind of done with that at this point as we've discovered all the vehicles we feel like we would need we've been testing a lot of different vehicles for different gigs and 
Yeah, I don't know that we have much really to complain about other than that some of the vehicles we thought would be good because they look good on paper. <laughs> um, well, we learned the lesson that you don't need to necessarily trust that paper stats is all that matters. All right, let's make sure that we're stuck here. Welcome back, bro. Thank you, bro. Slowly make my way down. It's a reasonable area. I hope I can get through this so I hope. There we go. Please put a winch in front of me. Thank you. I try not to do. I try not to winch too much because those times you don't have an winch option, you need to work out a way through. Right. Well, I will encourage you, my good friend, to watch what it is that I've been dealing with. Oh uh, yeah, of course. No, that's different. But I mean, in, in some cases, you, you know what I mean, man. Oh, absolutely. I've been plenty stubborn when it comes to winching, trying to avoid yeah. it, and all that. You're like that. Like, you try not to winch because it's like you're giving up when you winch. Ah! Yeah! We are victorious! Freaking up on the road again, everybody. Heck yeah. And Stewie is just down the hill from us, so maybe, 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 maybe we can go grab this big boy and get him to come with us. Get the king. Don't want to leave him stranded out here. All by his lonesome. Oh, I'm putting along. At a nice, um, steady 20 miles per hour, I'm guessing that is. Yeah, are you, did you Next already reload kilometer. your cargo? Kilometers and, yeah, I already reloaded on my on move. That's awesome. Yeah, so to those of you who are new to the channel here, we are doing um, we are doing the, the traditional SnowRunner missions here. We're not focusing on modded vehicles, anything like that. We are big on this thing with uh, Natural Vanilla Challenge because that's where the fun is. But we will down the road be working on some modded vehicles and. While we're on the topic of modded vehicles, go stop right here. Stop right here. I know you're big and heavy, but you can stand. There you go. Thank you. Perfect. Um, we've spent a fair bit of time going through different maps and such to get these vehicles. And I don't know, Steve. Would, with what the king can do and how it performs. I don't know that there's really any point in getting mods other for other than for the fact of having this fun. There's a great mod community out there that's made a lot of cool stuff. But that's more again on the cool gadgety stuff. It's not so much the the vehicles in the vanilla part of the game are, are too seven, because that's really not the case. Okay. And here she goes. Also, what I wanted to add for those of you who are jumping in just here, might I suggest... Oh, perfect. Hey, bro. Oh, come on. Freaking attach to him. I don't need no attaching. I'm good. I wasn't trying to help you. I'm trying to help myself. Oh, okay. You need me to back up or are you good? I'm trying to grab onto you, but it's grabbing onto everything but you. I'm erecting trees, apparently. Uh, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come uh, on. Maybe I turned my engine off, and that's probably why. No, maybe. I don't know. Anyhow. Oh, what are you doing? Is that what you wanted? No. Do you see me now? Oh. Yes. Okay. Let's see. Refuel. 
Oh, you're in tank. that one. Nope. I didn't look on the map. I just pulled up and I seen a truck in front of me and I thought it was you. <laughs> yeah, no, you're good. my way around so I can pull oh and thanks for the few yeah you're welcome I reckon you spent a little bit coming up here so I figured might as well and 70 something I think left all right you ready to go yeah that one's it I'll catch up, I'm sure. All right. I had a slight case of single track brain just then. So for all of those who are new to the channel, we, we are going into the modded vehicles and such down the road, but we are wanting to play through and show you how to do things, how not to do things with, with the vanilla vehicles. And one thing that we've found is there's plenty of these trucks, you know, like the King that we're in right now, it's called Zix 6, let's see, 605R, and then the as of 7, 71, 90 something, Shu's going to have to answer that one because he's actually in it. Alright, let's um, start the engine on this guy, and what are we stuck on? The as of 7, 3, 2, 10. Yeah, that one. Those are probably the better uh, vehicles that we've found, and we really do enjoy those. So please feel free to watch through the channel there uh, on our SnowRunner playlist. There's plenty of those tutorials on how to obtain this particular vehicle that I'm in, the one behind me, the one that Stu is riding in, as well as some pretty good scouts. And it's nice and early in the game. Exactly. Yeah, when we went and got the king, that was, um, I think, episode six with all those different parts. It's well worth it. It's a long trek, but if you're, you know, avoiding all the mistakes that we did, I think the average time you're spending on it, and yes, you will spend some hours. I think the average time is three to four hours. And it's well worth it because this truck right here has saved us oh so many times going through this crap so I would you know starting all over again this would be one of the first trucks that I would go after that and the Tuz oh. the Tuz 420 oh boy well there was a f remember that starter truck I told you about it's not that good for later on but at, right at the start it can, it can be alright talking about the Chevy um the CK 1500? No, no not, the, not the little truck. That's better later on. Um, that other truck that I... I'll have to buy it again and show you what one at some point. Or just come up with a name. Um, but yeah. It's on, it's on the... Uh, I think it's on my other account. There's some good options out there for sure to start off with. And the great part about it is as you're going along throughout all these maps you'll, you'll come across vehicles that you know you don't really care for and such sell them because you get the exact amount of dollars back of what you put into them and that's freaking amazing by my account because it lets us get rid of you know trucks we don't want and we can test things out and buy them and try them out and then figure, discover that you know what this wasn't exactly what we wanted and there you go. Not the, the job, you need to change the feet, whatever. Alright. Change truck. Well, that didn't work because I was just too far behind there. How you doing? Oh, the one yeah, pretty good, I think. Um, the one that's really good is like the saddles. The low one and the high one, they're free. Yeah, so what he's talking about is the fifth wheel hookups.
I, I don't know where you are. I'm just driving. Oh, there you are. How's that? What timing? Oh, nearly went too far. Need me to change my life direction? Or are you good? No, it's perfect. Thank you, bro. Yeah, that's the one good thing we also like about SnowRunner versus the other ones like Mud Runner is the, the light is actually shared, which is really good. All right, let me grab, let me get rid of this sucker and buy a fuel and repair trailer so we can repair up. See, how are you doing on on everything? I just need fuel. I haven't taken any damage whatsoever. Okay, I know what this guy has, so I will... Not from my spare wheels. That's the other good thing about this truck. Um, I think because the way the wheels are, if you just take your time, um, especially in those dips, because that's when you do end up smashing the front. Um, if you just take your time, you don't really scratch him up too much unless you hit a rock with your tire like hard oh what all right you're gonna have to give me a truck this is getting annoying all right looks like we uh wasted them a few points on stewie just then <laughs> <laughs> i just took them back with me home that's all right. So at least, at least my trailer's you. still sitting there. Just got to give me a truck now. Yes. Yeah, we try to be smart about it. For those of you yep. that are new here, uh, when you have friends playing in your session, in case there's interruptions like the one you just saw and the one you would have seen us have plenty of, you, as the admin to the sessions or whatever, um, just buy all the equipment. It's easier. Way easier. Alright, so now I gotta steer this back up. Okay, that was a little too much. Nope, 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 other way. Other way. There we go. Oh, that's gonna hit the video thing, damn it. Um. Oh, you're watching this, the stream? Yeah, by accident. Try to hit the arrow down. Okay, I am sucking too much of this right now. Uh, why did I want that for again? That's right, okay. This way. Yep. Come on. <laughs> Trip. Let's just do that. That works. Yep. There we go. Perfect. Spin it around. Then let's grab some fuel before we sell it. Because apparently I just wasted a few gallons. Refuel. Perfect. And then sell it. We are still on the lookout for Sasquatch, for, remind me, oh yeah, the wolf, I think there was a, t what, okay, um, you have my permission to, you know, act like a freaking normal trailer and stop losing your legs.
This is so annoying. Yeah, you want to know something also that's annoying? What's that? The trailer you were just in. Yep. It had the legs down, and then when I rolled back up to it, uh, you know, jump in it. It dropped to the floor. Yep. Straight to the floor. If the cargo is still connected, can we connect to the cargo and use the crane? I'm using the crane right now to try to lift it, but the problem is the crane that I have here is so freaking weak. Okay. Let's see, if I can lower my suspension. My other question would be, with two different people with two different cranes lock onto the same, uh, two different cargo on the same trailer? I don't know, if the cargo is not attached, maybe. Well, then that's pointless. It needs to be attached. And it's not letting me in. It's, yeah, it's annoying. We have to reboot that again. Uh, okay, is this even going to do anything for us? That's the question. Well, no, it looks like I have an attachment point on the cargo itself. And the cargo is not even hooked onto it. Okay. So I guess I'll just take the cargo off. Because it looks like we're going to have to manually load that again anyways. Yeah, that's fine. It doesn't bother me. Just let me in. Is it the code that's not working? Yeah, I keep trying and it fails to connect. That okay. other issue that, yeah. Okay, let's keep an eye out for that save then, because I have not looked at it. <sighs> okay. Friggin' stupid. Yes. The joys of snow runner these days. Oh. You call them joys now, do you? No, oh, that's. That, I know that's, what you mean. I'm just joking. Um. It's more like the joys of the connection game. Can we establish a connection? <laughs> uh, no, so we cannot. Well, until you tell me you, you, whatever, I'm gonna continuously just keep trying. And so let's me in. Force your way through? Yeah. Let me in. Just bashing on the door. Maybe that was enough. Let's go a little bit. And, what, and I'm thinking about that thing that I read about forcing the save. Maybe what it means is you know how you got those, uh, like, that menu option where. You've got multiple like areas and stuff, like the like push start and then hit. Uh, I think it's the uh, the Y or the other button. I can't remember what button it is, but then puts you into like the globe aspect. All the region stuff. Oh, 
You've got to be kidding me. So I can't even use this truck in this stupid trailer. Well, that's good to know. Wait, did you say... How did you say that then? Can't use this truck on this stupid trailer. Yeah. Trailer has... Um, fifth wheel hookup that's I have the high whatever the heck you call that and you use oh, the yeah. low one so yeah yeah I use the low one which is kind of good because then I'm low and you're high with different options yeah but at the same time not because then I can't use what you're using yeah, I know, but um, when I'm in there, then we don't have that problem. Mm, 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 okay, good to know. Why? <sighs> Configuration issues, that's all. Alright. Why isn't the save popping up? Well, doesn't matter. To hell with it. Main menu. Let's go. You guys get to see the whole spectrum of it all. There's no uh, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory m magic over here. That's for sure. All right. You ready for the code? Um, One. Just send it to me, yeah. Just rebooted my game just in case. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Three bags full, sir. If I can buy that as of. Um, what's it under? Heavy duty? Off road? Heavy? Heavy, heavy duty, I think. No, heavy. No. Off road. Uh, are you serious? She's not available in America. Let's hope this works. Let me in. Oh, I'm kicking on the door. We have lift off. Okay, I'm gonna be an ass to you now. Or oh, why? Give me a minute. Let me get in properly first. Um. All right, I'm in properly. Thought you were gonna do that. That's fine. Since I'm funding the mission again, we're having to run to Russia to get the truck. What truck because are we getting? I'm going to let you take one wild guess. The truck that I like. Is that your wild guess? Yeah. Truck store. What's here? Yeah. Oh, I'm right. Hey, what's this Don 71 thing? Don't know. Buy it. Bring it. 
Just don't hit A, hit X when you buy it, because you have five seconds. Four, That's three, X. two, oh. one. Bye bye. I right, got it. Oh, just in time. <laughs> uh, <laughs> just in time, dude. Alright, customize, put the good engine in there, sell the shit engine, put the good tranny right, in right. there. What the heck is this little... Alright, let's have a look. Put the good tires on it, and sell the crap ones. Put the good winch on it, and sell the crap one. Spare tires, let's put a snorkel on it. What's the stuff? Where even is the... Oh. That's just a shatter from that, okay. And then you want... I know you want the blue crane, but then what else do you want? Um, is that low, was it? The, yes, yes, the low one. Okay. You want some lights uh, on the roof? Away with the um, fender? Uh, yes, please. Solid front bumper. And we'll put some beacons up there. Yeah, and I want the ca air, uh, air con, cabin air con if you can. Listen to this guy. I want, I want, I want, I want. Yeah, he's got to be, he's got to be cast like come comfy, yeah. Does he now? Yeah. Um. Oh. You want a walrus? That no, you want that Hawaiian girl. It was. And yeah. And you wanted the green natural flavor. Green Garden, organic premium maybe. Uh, yes, please. That's the one. Organic premium. Okay, organic. Yep. We're going. Curtains, some blue curtains on there. Uh, stickers. yep. Stickers. What's the sticker you want? Uh. The sticker was the dirty one. The dirty one. I think. On the inside, it's probably. <sighs> Off-road club, park where I want. A uh, clean truck. Oh, hey, right. this this vehicle has a spare tire in the back of the vehicle, like in the back seat area, inside the actual vehicle. That's a change, isn't it? Dirty good boy. And... No truck, no life. Trucking. They like it dirty. Uh, Big and dirty. Climber. Big and dirty. Big and dirty. Yeah, that's what I did. Alright, she's parked up front. Alrighty, let's look at this one. Okay, that looks like typical lore right there, but that could probably be fun. <laughs> that looks like typical lore though. Oh my gosh, what's the name on that a, sucker? Um, uh, it's uh, Dawn seventy one, huh? Okay. Yep. Cool, cool. Good to know. I'm gonna leave him here. Change truck. Are you out of that one? Yeah, and don't buy a trailer down there. Come, come. Get rid of the trailer you have up here. Yeah, yeah, I know. I'm gonna come get that trailer up there. Ready? I'm on my way. I'm on my way. I'm on my way. Oh, win my way. I'm on my way. Okay, you know what? You're on your way. I'm gonna be freaking on my way too here in a second because I can't do any. Wait, are you are you coming from the garage? Yeah, I have to kick the low saddle on him. Uh, 
Alright. Let's go. Can't see yet. Which way is the quickest way? I'm assuming. This way I'm going. Actually. Because this time we can cut up through that shortcut because we're not carrying the trailer. Yeah, but let's cut up through the shortcut that goes uh, up next to the. Um... Ooh. Oh my gosh. Oh yeah, that's right. I have to do that. Uh, it's northeast of the dam. You know that with the that had that little island in the middle with the flag. Yeah, I'll have a look in a second. Oh, there's so much smoke coming out from behind me. I can can't even see ya. Oh, I'm in the cockpit. Yeah, same. Looking behind. So much smoke coming out behind. I can't see ya. Here, let's uh, cut into the farm, yeah. Oh, so turn right here, you reckon? Yep. Oh, hey, bro. How you doing? Sorry. see you if you've got something. Did you raise your suspension? Because I forgot to do that. Um, no, I haven't, but I don't have much problem getting through here. I reckon it will be even easier for you. Alright, hang a left right here. Cut through the field, say. I'm hoping to get you not to have to stop. And then try to make your way over to the road that I'm on. Go right after oh, no. the orchard, right there. There you go. Cut through the trees. Straight ahead of you. Yep, perfect. Yeah, look turn. at these seven souls. You doing good? Well, yep. As you said that, and I was about to answer, I was I like plummeted down because of the ditch. I'm like, oh, yep. <laughs> Isn't that a bitch to get through? It was actually quite alright. It's just I turned a little too late. Oh. And I mean, you know, it's your fault when you can't make the turn in this thing. You know what I mean? Yes, that's very true. Oh. Oh, this dang nose on this truck, man. At least it's not, you know, prone to a lot of engine damage that way. That would have been annoying. Yeah, this, I'm, I'm really like this truck. I like this one more than the king, sorry to say. Oh, that's alright. The king has a special place in my heart, though. All that power. Yeah, I'm finding this thing to have to be pretty good, though. That's what I mean. Yep. It definitely has power, too. But when we're comparing apples to apples. Well, Listen isn't that a pretty good thing? Just have a tow challenge, right? Hook up to the back yeah. end of each other and put a, um, what do you call it, a, a fuel tank on the back. What the frick was that that just flew out from underneath me and gave me heaps of damage? Well, that was a heaps, but whatever. Alright, you see me down here? I just want to make sure you cut down onto the beach. Uh, yeah, I'll see you down there. Okay. Just be careful on the beach here. Oh, 
come on. I haven't, I haven't tipped in first person yet. It's gonna look interesting, actually. Come to think about it. Yeah, when we were doing those seismic uh, charges, to, when we were doing the TUS missions, I was driving in first person when I almost tipped it over. It was like resting pretty much on the side, but it didn't kill the engine. So I kind of just looked out at the window and was like, okay, yeah, we best do something about this before I tip all the way. <laughs> oh, I feel like the same right now. What the heck? You good or you're going to need a hand? Um... Oh, no, I'm tipping, I'm tipping. Oh! I'll keep. At least right now you can't tell me as I'm working my way back to you. Ah, I'm good. No, nah, well, I, I can't fix it. Or can I? No, you can't. No, <laughs> no, there's no, there's... Or, or can I? No, you can't. <laughs> no, 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 I got it. Tripper! Okay. <laughs> I'm determined though, I'm thinking different ways, like going maybe this way, that way. No, no. Can't do this, can't do that, nothing works. I'm just making myself up. Alrighty. Where you headed? Up this way and left. Trooper, it's back down this way. Which way are we going? This way. Uh, You're like, nope, I'm done with this uh, waterfront. Get me the hell out of here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Time to get our stilettos on. Walk in the high heels. Are we going across this, are we? This is a shortcut. This way we can avoid all them twisties going up that mountain. end up pretty much right with the uh, tunnel. Nice. Oh, water's pushing me a little. Yep, you gotta compensate a little. damage then this looks a lot like a fire truck don't you reckon yeah a little yeah, the right bits on the back, then yeah. Well, if you take the service truck, it looks a lot like a fire truck, I reckon, if you do that. Let's take the high heel shoes off. Alright, what you did the suspension oh I'm did the suspension down. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Just noticed the edge there. Maybe this will make it a little easier. Oh yeah, thank you. Keep forgetting. Oh No, it was close. And you probably just missed it. Yeah, I looked back as as I heard that. But hey, Started. you made it. That's the main thing, right? You made it. Yep. 
Hey, chew over there, yep. <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting on you. King was having a hard time going up up this road. But that was also, and I think, before we upgraded the engine and uh, fanning and such. So let's have see you got the suspension down in that? I have it down, yeah. Yeah, see, so we haven't even got suspension up yet, so. Yeah, but remember, as I just said, it didn't have the engine upgrades or the transmission upgrade like this one does. True. Which is a substantial difference. But yeah, you can definitely tell this guy's crawling up a lot faster. How you doing down there, bro? I just spawned you. Almost at the top. Yikes. Here's the king, sitting pretty. Did I go the wrong way or something? No. Yourself under. I don't care about how we do it, as long as we can get you attached. There, now you can probably take over with your crane. Just let me know when to let go. Okay. I'd really like to grab that one over there. Oh, you just want to grab the one right over the fifth wheel, lift it up, and put it onto you. And I'll drive out of the way. Yep, perfect. And then reel it back into you so you have a little more strength on the arm. And then I'll get out of your way now. Oh. Um. <clears throat> it's alright, I'll fix that up for you. I guess not. Are you pulling in, you know, pressing Y? I was and I, I, I did and I didn't. Like. Okay, bring the arm down. One. Yeah. Press Y, and then keep it pulling towards yourself as well as you pressing the left bumper. There you go. Now, jump out of the menu. Go into the attach thing. There you go. Perfect. All right, and then just reset yourself. 
And I'll get um, a service trailer for us and refuel us and repair us real quick. So just sit right there. Refuel. Am I close enough or do I have to go back a bit more? I'm good. Yeah. Go and then repair. Um, is he, yeah, I was going to say, has he got any parts? Yeah, that's why I brought this one. Alright. Thank so you. We fully repaired and then let's sell this sucker and buy. This one. All right. And then you have all your parts. Don't forget to get them. They're right behind you there. You see them? Uh, yep. Um, I think I should grab these right now. I'll, uh, I'll work on them with you. Oh, what the heck? I was doing One sec. What an idea. Might just work. As long as you can just reach them, even. That's all you pro. Yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing. Wait, 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 wait. What do you need me to wait for? Oh, because you're bumping them, and I want to be there. I wasn't bumping them. Yeah. Oh, well, on my, on my screen, apparently. They're just jumping around and moving. We're, as soon oh, as we okay. get close to them, they kind of release. Does that make sense? Yeah. The world, like, detaches them. Same with the when, you know, your vehicle and crap. Sorry. Um, but... That's as far as I'm going to bring them to you, I guess. It's kind of silly. Okay. Well, screw it. I might as well just pick one up, yeah? Or not. Come on. I can't. Cargo and store the crank. If you can't reach, I can try to get my trailer under you. I'm good. Yeah, you guys can see. Hang on, bro. Just give it one second. So I can get over there. You guys can see. It doesn't have to be perfectly on. And then he just hits the pack cargo. Got to unpack it and then pack it again. And boom. So you don't have to have a super long crane to pack it up properly. At least there's that automation to it. All right, I'm in. And away we go. Yep. Toss a like on the video if you don't mind. We're teaching you some stuff here and there. And for those of you who are veterans, toss a couple beers down in the comment section below, yeah? And as always, if you have any feedback, we really do enjoy them and we try to be as fast as possible on answering. Anything you want to tell the audience people, uh, Stewie? Um, take care, y'all, and, uh, Stay dirty. Amen to that. We'll see you all in the next one.